Hey guys, here we go. December 4th, fourth day on my secret spirit. I mean, no, no, it, it's not secret spirit because that's the ones you buy. This is the blind spirit advent calendar. Uh, December 4th, I think I've done said that. So, thanks for joining in. Let's get after it. Oh yeah, and the toys, so, because Bart has toys on his. Because why shouldn't I? And the green thing in the middle, because it's a reloading thing, sometimes I roll my own. Gun guy. Oh. Hey, at least we went back to a bourbon. Nice. Well, let's give it. Oh, I see a nose. Okay, so. Yes, it's bourbon. Um. Hmm. Bit of barrel, bit of alcohol. Some sweetness there towards the back, but you know what? I don't buy this stuff to smell it. Mm. and hopefully well I said don't open any of the new bottles so this is something that I have already had which is good kind of a like most of them a little sweetness up front little bit of burn not a very long finish um, not bad not bad by any means um, probably uh, I'm gonna guess mid 40s for ABV Yeah, yeah, I'd say this is a, uh, a couple of sips and the finish gets a little longer, which is good. A um, little bit woody on the back end, which is good. I like that. I'd say so far it's a keeper. So, big reveal. You didn't see my toy. I don't want to talk about toy. If you got a question about the toy, you can ask. So, let's just see what this is. I have to change it up. Since I changed locations, I went with a... I might move around a bit. Oh, I recognize the bottle here. Angel's Envy. So, was I right on the on the ABV? Hey, 43.3. So, I said mid 40 cents. I'll take that as a win. So, obviously, it's been, I've been in this bottle. Some of it went in um, <clears throat> some eggnog that I made. Thank you, Jesse. So, we will do a, a, a value on this one. So I gave, I, know I did not mark this bottle. But I remember buying this one at home in Tennessee and it was $40 for the bottle. Uh, and of course, what you, I'm sure everybody here watching this knows that it's a, it's a, so it's a Kentucky straight bourbon and it's finished in port wine barrels. Uh, so it's, if it's Kentucky straight, that's saying that it's a two year age statement, but I don't know what that says on the side. Let's see. Just the batch and the bottle number. So batch 41M, bottle number 88. Uh, nothing there. So, so I gave, like I said, $40 for this back home in Tennessee, around the Chattanooga area. That's not where I'm at right now. This stuff is $50 a bottle here. That's the, uh, I don't think I've seen it any lower than $49.99, whatever. So at 50 bucks a bottle, I don't know, you're, you're kind of, for me, everybody's different. For me, that's kind of pushing the upper end of, of whether or not this is a good value. I mean, it's still good. It's still a good drinker. Um, I don't know that I would say it's a, it's, you know, any kind of, anywhere near a fantastic value at, at 50. At 40, it's pretty good value. Yeah, that's just 10 bucks. 10 bucks didn't, shouldn't be breaking you for a luxury item anyway, but. Seems like I remember this being a little sweeter when I first got it. It does got a good finish though. I'm gonna add just a drop of water. That's more than a drop. Just to see, because it's been a while since I've 
had any of this. <clears throat> Ooh, that that made the alcohol come out on the nose. Okay, so for me, no water. Uh, even though I just added water. No water. I probably need to mark that on the thing when you get it. NW, no water. Anyway, so there it is. December 4th, my fourth day of my blind advent calendar. Hope you all are enjoying this as much as I am. Uh, cheers. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for subscribing. All that kind of good stuff. Um, comments. Like it. Don't like it. Don't care. <laughs> Either way, drop a comment. Love to hear from you. Um, thanks again for tuning in. Cheers.